Ah, people. Show no mercy. You're witnessing a biblical piece of work here by the beast known as Sandy Ravage. And you'll notice Sandy Ravage is equipped with a sparse shotgun or whatever the hell it is. It's a straight up beast gun. And then some little bitch tries to get the clean shot on Sandy. But being an athletic beast, it's not gonna happen. Look at that straight up beast right there. Come again, son! Look at that straight up beast hanging out the window. These boys ain't know what hit them. As a matter of fact, this man took on nine guys by himself, basically. A one man army here. They should make a patch for Sandy Ravage in this game. Because he's an unstoppable force. Look at this shit! Look at this shit! I mean, serious, Predator missile right off the bat. And then some little bitch comes around the corner and gets a lucky shot on him. Now, Sandy Ravage sensed that these boys are gonna quit. So he missed on purpose with that Predator missile. He knew that these soldiers were ill equipped to deal with a man of his caliber. And then that guy gets him up there. That's alright, make it count. Because you ain't gonna get too many more of them. You better make it count. So look at that dumbass trying to shoot at him. So what's he do? He takes the back door. And he sees a little bitch trying to cower in the corner. And he blasts his ass. And then always on the move. Look at this shit. Look at this. Boom! Boom! And notice how fast he moves. With a cat. Look at that cat. Look at that. Look at that cat camping over. That's all right. Make it count, son. You ain't gonna get many more of them. You ain't gonna get many more of them. He come around the corner right where he got killed. He's gonna look for him again. And then some little bitch gets him again. Now, you got the beast mad now. Sandy Ravage is visibly upset, and he's going to take it out on these ill-equipped soldiers. He comes around, he gets stuck on that Volvo, but that ain't going to stop his boss now, is it? Hell no. It ain't going to stop his ass, he's a beast. Then he sees this dumbass trying to drink a cup of coffee, and he makes it his last one, because that's what he does. Look at this dumbass here. Boom! Double kill. This man is a straight-up beast. Like I said. And then this guy gets a lucky shot off. Like I said, you better make it You better make it count, son. You better make it count. Because I'm going to tell you right now. If it ain't going to count, you're going to be done. Look at that. He parlays this grenade throw over there. Goes up the steps. Son, get out the way. That's Sandy Ravage you're standing in front of. Then he jumps over, kills that bastard. And then this bastard gets a lucky shot off. That's bullshit. That's all right, though. Make it count. I'll take five deaths against 40 kills all the time. And that's what the beast does. He's just straight up beast in this game. Someone throws a grenade, what's he do? Look at the quick like cat like reflexes. Quick legs. Boom! Boom! Double kill my ass. That's a triple kill. Get it right, game. That ain't gonna look at this dumbass with his back turn. Back turn to that spot, you're done. And then this dumbass so scared he shits his pants and kills himself. Look at that dumbass, runs into his own play more. Or game more. Look at the predator missile. Straight up beasting being done here. Straight up Spostin! These motherfuckers ain't know what hit him. Matter of fact, to save endless life, look at this shit! Straight up heroin strike now! He's straight up beasted. And look at this cat like reflex. That's time to deploy a harrier or a precision. Look at this shit! Son, you ain't getting cover here! You ain't getting cover here! Ain't gonna happen! <clears throat> so now it's gonna do a goddamn precision airstrike and devil kill. Notice I'll say that a lot. Because it just keeps happening. So he gets the gay C-130, he ain't even gonna use it yet. You know why? He wants to find more people to kill. Look at that shit. A thing of beauty, people. So now, Sandy Rabbit's gonna deploy the gay C-130 and take a break for a while. Now you'll notice I say this numerous times. Double kill. Triple kill. Double kill. Triple kill. You might as well just keep repeating it. Because that's what keeps happening. These other good soldiers are terrified. Petrified, horrified, humidified, and Sammy Ravage is glorifying it. He's just straight up beasting them. I mean, say, I wish I could play this way, but unfortunately, I don't have a tenth of a sixteen of these. Cause the triple kill again. It's a thing of beauty. Like I said, they need to make a patch for this man. Because man, seriously, how the fuck can you combat the uncombatables? You can't do it. Matter of fact. People in the lobbies ought to just quit the game. Admit defeat. Save their lives. Save them while they can. Look at this dumbass. Man, son, you better come strong. Boom. You're done. You're done. How many more lives does he have to end? Just give up. Wave the white flag. Now, look, he, look, he, just, look, he sees a guy over there, but you know what? He knows where they're at. He's going to go, you're done. 
He just knows what he's doing. This this guy is a straight up beast. I love watching. Look at that. Son, son. You better run quicker. Then you're gonna run into a spot. I mean, how many more do you have to kill? S save your own life. Look at this shit. Another double kill. Save your own life. The Marty Dom ain't gonna work. So then he has to reload, but you know what? He says, you know what, man? Fuck it. I need one more kill to end this travesty. He traumatized this team. You know what he says? I ain't gonna reload. I'm gonna traumatize with one bullet. And what's he do? He jumps out the window and must have ate his Wheaties because he ends the game. On a standing, leaving jump in midair. It ends the game. That's the thing of beauty, people. Look at that. He beats the fight so bad that the connection got interrupted. Look at that shit. That guy was saved by the shitty ass Infinity Ward servers. That's the only reason that guy was saved. That is straight up beastifying people. And I want to thank Sandy Ravitch for giving me this opportunity to commentate on this biblical piece of work.